Another week, uh, another batch of rain, and another edition of Take 5 here on St. Joseph's All Access. Matt Martucci with uh, St. Joseph's softball sophomore transfer, Shannon Kramer. That's a mouthful. So softball sophomore transfer. Welcome to uh, Take 5. Thanks for having me. Now, you're a transfer student. Easy first question. Uh, what was the reason for, uh, for coming over to St. Joseph's? Um, I wanted to be closer to home, firstly. My family's a big part of softball and always has been. So it's easier for them to hop on the school kill and take an hour drive down to see me play. And I love it here. It's very welcoming. The coach I love to play for and a lot of the girls I've played with in the past. So it just feels more home when I play here. Now, uh, you were just recently honored as the Atlantic 10 Player of the Week. Uh, teams obviously doing very well. Mm -hmm. You've had some good early season success. Uh, was already uh, just talking to Monica uh, Aguilar last week uh, mm -hmm. about the fact that you guys had already gotten to, uh, what was it, 20 wins. Yeah. And now you get honored as the A-10 Player of the Week. What does that mean to you, uh, obviously, to, to receive an honor like that? And does it, does it motivate you a little more uh, after you get something like that? Or, uh, you know, are you, are you just cool with that? I'm cool with it. I, want, I mean, it shows how good our team is. Like, Monica got the A-10 Player of the Year. Byrne just got it. So it just shows how well-rounded our team is this year. And it just motivates you to want to achieve more. Like, this is a good achievement, and I'm proud of it. But I want to get more. Like, a is our goal. And you mentioned about the 20 wins. We want to continue and reach our goal of 30. So. Now, you're from uh, nearby Philadelphia. You mm -hmm. mentioned about an hour outside. Yep. Do, what's your favorite vacation spot? Do you have one? Ocean City, Maryland. Ocean City, Maryland. Mm -hmm. And why is that? Uh, I love going with my family and friends. They have one of the best seafood buffets I've ever they been do. to. Phillips? Uh, not Phillips. There's a place called the, I think it's the Embers Club 25. Yeah, it's like, I've uh, been there. It's like $25 a person mm -hmm. or something like that, but, but really liked it. So Every that, time I go down there, I go there. That's my plug for, yeah. uh, for Ocean City, <laughs> Maryland. Now, in softball, you generally have a lot of doubleheaders. Mm -hmm. There's some downtime in between. What do you like to do just to kind of stay loose in between game one and game number two? Do you have a set routine? Is there anything that you do to, to keep your composure? Not really. Just if something bad happened the game before, just forget about it. It's in the past and just focus on the next game and get something to eat and just sit down and wait for the next one to start. Finally, easy fifth question. Which of your teammates has the worst walk-up music? <laughs> when, when, when you sit and think about it, when, when their song comes over the PA, you're just like, what were they thinking? I don't know. Everyone has a really good one this year. If you had to pick one, <laughs> um, we're putting you on the spot here. I know. Hmm. Probably Dana B next. What does she come up to? I don't know. You don't know the song? I don't want to answer this question. <laughs> you don't want to answer the question? No. no. I like everyone's, and we all, we all as a team picked them together. So... No one has a bad one. All right, that's fine. We don't want to single anybody out. We appreciate that. And uh, obviously a very good rapport with your team. Everybody gets along well. So, yes, uh, we do. You don't want to throw anybody under the bus. We no. appreciate that. Because well, everyone has their own opinions of what they like. That's exactly so. right. So, Shannon, we appreciate you stopping by here on Thank Take you. 5. You've survived. And uh, congratulations again on that Thank Atlantic you. 10 Player of the Week award. Okay. Thank you. That's St. Joseph's softball sophomore transfer. Once again, Shannon Kramer, another guest here on St. Joseph's All Access and Take 5. Join us every week where we uh, highlight another student athlete, ask them five questions. For St. Joseph's All Access, I'm Matt Martucci. See you next week on another edition of Take 5.